How do I look? Ready and set to give to the kill. Thank you, my love. You're welcome. Honey, mm -hmm. as you step out, you step out in the name of the Father. Amen. And of the Son. Amen. And of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In Job chapter 22, verse 28, Thou shalt decree a thing, and it shall be established unto thee, and the light shall shine upon thy ways. Honey, the word is yours to take over. Take over in Jesus' name. Amen. I decree and declare you a national success, a global icon. In your industry, you will always be at the top. Amen. You will be a voice to reckon with. Amen. The world is yours to take charge. Amen. Take charge by the grace of our Lord in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right, baby. You got to run. All right, honey. Have a great day. Have a great day. I wish you a very bad day. You wish me a very bad day? And I wish you lose everything that you've ever worked for, including me. Unfortunately, losing you is not such a bad thing, is it? Yeah, hey. Oh, I will have it delivered today. I will also schedule a meeting to set up a committee. All right, all right. Once again, thank you for your continuous patronage of our business. Thank you very much. The most handsome man ever. The most beautiful woman ever. Odogun. Mm-hmm. Achalu mm -hmm. <laughs> My mm. best ever. Now you're good to go. Am I good to go? Of course. How do I look? You look really sharp. Mm. Thank mm -hmm. you. So, your lunch is at the dining. Lunch? Mm hmm Maybe you know you really didn't have to, right? Come on, don't say that. Mm -hmm. I have to. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Wife of my youth. The best of the best. <laughs> Take care of yourself. I will see you later. Husband of my youth. Mm hmm My baby girl. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, honey. Take care of you. Bye, baby. You're looking good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Say it again. You are a rope, a barrel, a book. You are a rope, a book. You will not work. Ah, okay. Good morning, sir. Hey, sir. Sir. Good morning. How Good morning, are you? sir. Fine, sir. Sir, is there anything you want me to do for you? Actually, no. Okay, sir. of my youth. Thank you so much. I got your message. <clears throat> okay. So let me get ready and spend the money. <laughs> Good morning. 
morning. Hey. Good morning, Jairus. How morning, are you? I'm fine, ma. Yeah. Well done. Thank you. Um, so I'm stepping out. Okay. When you're done cleaning, before you go, yes, make sure you prepare something nice to eat. Uh, me? Yes, you. <laughs> Thank you, ma. And um, don't forget to lock the door and keep the key at the usual yes, place. Thank you. Bye. Thank you, Ma. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Just say I should make whatever I want for myself. Wow. <laughs> ah, no, no lie. Ah, I'll set up. No, 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 this one I'll set up. Why Madame Go won't set me up now? Ah, if this one a temptation, eh? I don't fall. Temptation. What's this about? Val, there is a problem. What problem? Boss is upset with you. In fact, some policemen are on their way to arrest you. What? Police? You know, if they arrest you, it will be the worst of it. Anthony told Madame everything. He told Madame how you plan to divert the Russian contractors to start up your own business. What? Yes! Jesus Christ, I, I didn't do any of that. But you know, Madame, she won't believe you. She won't. See, you need to go. I was want them to arrest you. So just go. No. You know, just whatever you hear, just let me know, okay? Don't worry, I'll keep you posted. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus Christ.
Oga. Oga, good afternoon, sir. Oga. Oga, good afternoon, sir. What's good about the afternoon? Some way or gag, we come back house. When I know a bell or enemy, he money me. When I know a bell, who do I want? How can I possibly lose my job? I mean, it's not like I did it. It was just one bad thought. One bad thought. Ah, Anthony, you no go better for you. I go go punish you. Quite early. <gasps> He's back so early. What? Honey! Honey! my job. No, you didn't. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. It was just, it was just a bad thought, okay? It's not something I even did. It was something I thought about. What bad thought are you talking about? So, a Russian company. Mm -hmm. They reached out to me. They said they wanted me to be their rep in Nigeria. And so I was talking to Anthony. You remember Anthony, that useless guy? How is he useless? Anthony is useless right now to me. What about Anthony? So I told Anthony, I said, I was just thinking, what if I divert the Russian company? I mean, start up my own firm, right? Rather than be a middleman between the Russian company and my, you know, yeah. Parent company and, and all of that and and he just went garnished the whole story and reported me to my boss and now she has fired me she has published on all of our whatsapp groups at work that I've been fired and to top it all all the police are looking for me what yes everywhere I went to the office today and I was I, I that, that was all I heard that was the first news that welcomed me this is deep waters. I, I don't know if I can swim out of this. I, I don't know what to do. Yes, yes, I'm, I'm actually sending an application now to them. What? Okay. Um, Energy Global at Gmail. Is it Gmail or Yahoo Mail? Gmail, okay. Gmail.com. All right, thank you. Who 
Oh, all right. 22 applications sent. Well, let's hope they call. Honey! Honey! If not apply for jobs upon jobs upon jobs. So, are you done? Yes, I'm done, and I have six interviews tomorrow, virtual interviews done. Don't worry, honey. Mm -hmm. You will get a job soon. Amen. My <laughs> wife. <laughs> Stop. Why don't you come? Let me lay my hands on you. Lay your hands on me. How about you sit on my face? You're very, very bad. Come, John. Is that how I married me? Come here. <laughs> bad boy. That's not what I asked you to do. Oh, I have an email. We are sorry, Mr. Valentine. The virtual meeting has been cancelled. As if they can even pay a first class graduate. What is wrong with them? On to the next one. Um, oh, it's now. <clears throat> Good morning. Good morning, Mr. Val. Let's get straight to the point. Yeah, let's get to it. We looked through your resume and we thought you are fantastic. And we hope you will be a great value to us. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. But unfortunately, we can't hire you. Sorry. Hello? He wait, hello? hello? <sighs> what's, what's going on now? OK, let me check. Cancelled. Cancel the... After a true selection process, you were selected. But when we check about you at the job up and what we saw influence our decision. Okay. <laughs> with all due respect, I, I am clean. Okay? I am registered with Job Hub and in fact I have no dirty record whatsoever. I mean you can confirm with there is a twist that no complaint or individual should employ Mr. Valentine at journey. He is greedy and a con man. He is a threat to the goals of any establishment. He divided investors to start up his own company until we caught him and have him fired. Here is a video evidence. A video that clearly shows everything was attached. Truth is nobody would take this risk. No one, Mr. Valentine. Have a good day. Wait, excuse me, let me. Hello? Hey, hello? Hello? Yes. Apparently, I've been blacklisted at a job hall. Um, honey, please. You need to calm down, okay? Don't be too hard on yourself. I'm calm. I'm calm. What, what is paining me? Is that stupid interviewer telling me that nobody will hire me? Do, does he know who I am? Does he know the university I graduated from? Mm -mm. Look, we are going to write a petition to revolt this, okay? It will be sorted out. It's all right. Just go. Thank you. 
to stop this. Eat your food, no. Talk to me, no. What else do you want me to do? You're acting as if I, I was the one that reported you to Job Hub. So why am I the one suffering for it? Why? You won't even talk to me. Hello? Hi, sister in law. Sister, please, you need to come and talk to your brother. He has been misbehaving since he lost his job. Wait, hold on. One at a time. You need to come and talk to him, or else I will call Mama. You mean Val lost his job? How? Please come and talk to him. Because I don't understand anymore. Wait, just hold on. Hold on, I'm coming. Just. Take everything easy. I am coming over, okay? All right, thank you. How? He lost his job? What happened? How are you, Essie? I'm fine, Ma. Thank okay. you. Um, Essie. Ma. Do you come here every day? Every day? Yeah. Uh, yes, I do. No, I mean, not every day, Ma. Sometimes, Sha. It depends. Can you just not confuse me? All right? Answer me. Not actually, Ma. Essie. Ma. Is it a yes or a no answer? I mean, yes, sometimes. No, most times. Anyway, the reason I was asking is uh, I wanted to know. Do you know what is happening? Happening? You mean in this house? Yeah, do you know if there's anything happening? No, apart from the weather. Nothing more. What about the weather? It's very hot, especially today's weather, ma. Gossip ambassador. Mommy won't put for one out to gossip mouth. What happened to that What happened to you? No, brother. Please, can you just stop this? Please, stop it. You are an intelligent man. Look, I understand how you feel. In no due time, they will call you back. You don't have to allow your family to suffer because of this minor issue. Shut your double-breasted lips. You're calling my pain minor. Are you calling my pain? I, I said I have lost the means of my livelihood and it's difficult for me to find another one. Are you calling my pain minor? I understand. It is huge. Yes, it is. But do we all have to cry because of it? Vicky, wait, are you the one saying this? I'm so surprised. I understand you. Trust me, it's not like I don't understand how you feel. I do. Yes, you were blacklisted. And so what? I'm 
And so what? Are you the first? Exactly my point. You're not the first. So why are you being so hard on yourself? Look Val, we will get you this together. Mm -hmm. I promise. We are not in this together. We are not in this together. Is it your name, Vicky, that is on the server as a dishonest staff? Is it? Or is it your name, my beloved wife, Amazon, that is on the server as a dishonest staff? Huh? I don't hear any of you talking. Why are you silent all of a sudden? Mm -hmm. We'll get through this together. Excuse me. Just give him time. He will come around, okay? Oh, please. This should be between us. Mom shouldn't know about this. Yes, of course, she shouldn't. Thank you. Um, I'll go check up on you. I'll just be on my way. I was heading out when you called me. <laughs> Thank you. Brother be sacked. He has worked so hard and invested his time in this company. Who must have sacked him and and why? I need to find out. I really do. Bye bye, Ma. This will not affect my salary. Hey, no, no. Oh, Oga na correct man na. Who go look Oga kon saka na correct man na. I saw your message. Yes, you were picked. Are you serious? I mean, you're a familiar person here. So the company is excited to bring you back on board. Wow, I, I, I'm excited. Wait, you mean I am coming back to work? You can come around today if you are free. Otherwise, tomorrow is still okay. Um, no, 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 I'm coming right away. Let me just quickly change then. I'll come to the office. Yes, thank you. I am freezing me work. Should I tell him? No, no, I need to be sure first. Let me go change. Maybe I should go with this car. It's not like it's going anywhere. Essay! Essay! Ma, I'm coming. Uh. Ma? Uh, get me the car key. Car key. Okay. Ma.
So, how are you doing? I'm fine, thank you, sir. So, here's a new office. Feel free to resume any time, any day. I'll get the documents containing your privileges and benefits. Congratulations. Wow, well, this is so good to be true, sir. It's, it's beautiful. Why are you surprised? You worked here during your industrial training, and after graduation, they made you an offer. I don't know why you refused. Uh, my husband didn't want me to work that time, but it's fine now. I'll work. Well, I'm glad to have you back here as a boss. Thank you, sir. Akata <laughs> General. <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. All right, come. Let me show you around. Okay. What is it? What is it? What have I done to you people? What, what exactly have I... Hello? Honey. Babe. Babe. Oh, 6 p.m. I overslept. Babe. Hey. Mm -hmm. oh, honey. Honey, you shouldn't be drinking. Sorry, I had to rush off when you were sleeping because I didn't want to disturb you. And I also borrowed your car. Where did you go? I got a job, and I'll be resuming work tomorrow. <laughs> I'm so excited. You got a job? Mm hmm And you're resuming work tomorrow? Exactly. And you're excited? Of course I'm excited. What's that? We both agree that you stay at home. <sighs> Honey, that arrangement can no longer hold. We need money to maintain this house. Who knows if the company will come here tomorrow to chase us out. So where are we going to move to? So I need to work. Now listen to me. And listen to me very, very attentively. I am the man of this house. Job or no job. I get to make the decisions, don't you? So you don't get to tell me what Arrangement stands and what arrangement does not stand. Do Don't even it? try to stop me, Val. Don't even try to stop me. What are you even saying? I got a job, a good position, a good salary, and you're telling me not to work? Don't even piss me off by trying to stop me. Well, you can't even stop me anymore. Anyway. So come back here, what, what does that make me? 
That makes me a husband, what? A house husband? Or maybe a housewife? These women, small situation changes and they change. Life. When are you moving out? So they've sacked me and now they want to render me homeless? Wait, hold on. Honey, why are you talking about moving out? Moving out to where? This house, the car, are for the company. But we have an option if you want both. The monthly rent of 500,000 naira. Honey, but you told me the car was yours. Well, honey, technically the car is mine. I only took a loan from the company to buy the car and I haven't finished paying for it yet. Uh, madam, please. We need this house and the car. I will pay the house rent. So how much is remaining to complete the car loan? He paid just 400,000 naira. Balance of 3 million naira. With the increased rate of dollar, it's additional 600,000 naira. Yes, you heard what? me. What? You heard me. The car price has nothing to do with dollar increment. Mr. Val, don't provoke me. I'm just here because of Madam's instructions. I shouldn't provoke you? Yes, don't. You're telling me not to, you're in my house and you're telling me not uh, honey, to provoke just you? Calm down. Relax, calm down. It's okay, just calm down. No, it, it's, 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 it's her guts for me. Just calm down, my love. Um, I'll sort it out. Better. Honey, I'm off to work. I'll see you when I get back. And what are you still doing there? Get out of my house. I'll pay up your money. Your filthy self out. Pay up your money. Of us again. Leaving Val alone at home. I pray he doesn't do anything to hurt himself. Let me call Essie. Hello, Essie. Good afternoon, sir. Madam said I should come and check on you, sir. Oga, I... 
is who you're going to the top. Who is your God or mental? Oga? Oga, have you eaten, sir? Oga? Oh, wow. Hello, Ma. Hello, Essie. Ma, I don't understand what they go on. Like someone or oh, oh, God on the mental. And what do you mean by that? I know it's not the talk, Madam. And if you say, you get with it. Essie, I need my food. Is that not his voice I'm hearing? Yes, sir. I will go and make your food now, sir. I just sent you an email. Um, kindly work on it. Yes, sure, I will. Okay, there'll be um, a dinner party in a casual meet and greet mm. for new employees to mingle and interact. A party? I don't understand. It's a newly introduced monthly ritual. Ritual? I mean, routine. Oh, better. <laughs> um, okay. So, head of department and board of Directors meet every last Friday of the month. It is compulsory. Time is 8 p.m. See you at 8. All right. Uh, 8 p.m. to a girl like this. I make I cook in food, they go to my house. I don't know if you stay the same house with this kind of person. Ha. Okay. Look, there is usually traffic around that um, freedom area. Please. Do you know what time it is? It is 10 p.m. And today is only day one of her job. That's what I'm saying. Maybe that's why she's not back home yet. Maybe she's trying to settle in. Uh, Vicky, stop making excuses for her. All right? I have checked it on Google Map. The room to my house and there is no gridlock. Just calm down. I'm begging you. I've heard you. I'm calm. Brother, please. Just be calm. Trust me, she's going to be back home. Okay? Is she back? I don't know. Let me check. I'll call you back. Calm down, no. I beg. Marriage, marriage palaver. Last Friday. 
I don't know how to. <laughs> yes, you're right. You know, I feel like I've been missing out on a whole lot of things. <laughs> yes, yeah, so outside is fun. <laughs> All right. Thank you. <laughs> thanks, thanks, thanks. Where are you coming from? Um, please let me call you back, okay? Yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. And thanks for the lovely evening. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Can you repeat yourself? It is 10.23 p.m. Every honest worker is back at home. Tops. Nine o'clock. So I repeat myself. Where are you coming from? Do you know you're very ungrateful? You're very ungrateful, Val. Look at someone that I built from a life-threatening debt. You have the effrontery to open your cotton mouth to ask me that silly question. Don't ever try this nonsense again. Got him out. Ready? You're going to quit that job. Over my dead body. Over my dead body will I quit my job. Also, you want me to sit here jobless? With a jobless husband? Is that what you want? Really? Yes. Really? Yes, really, Val. Really. What are you saying? I should quit my job. Are you normal at all? After helping you to pay the house rent for six months, that's three million naira, and helping you to offset the car loan, you want me to quit my job? I can see you're not normal. I can see you're not normal. Rubbish. And... I hope you know that I'm going to change the ownership of that card to my name. Oh. Yes. Hmm. I will change it. You might as well change the ownership of everything in this house that I own. Of course I will do that. It's not impossible. <laughs> Nonsense. <laughs> Doubless husband, right? Is that not what you are? A jobless husband? quit your job as if you will provide you will not provide yet you want me to quit my job who does that hmm. so what are you going to do i don't know i just got angry and i left the room wow this is really serious so. but then what did you do what exactly did you do to her I just asked her why she came late. She started saying a lot of things and then I asked her to quit the job. And then she started broke shaming me, calling me jobless and other kind of names. Huh. You know what? Don't worry, I'm coming to the house tomorrow. I'll look for a way to talk to her. Alright, thank you. Just calm down, okay? Good night. Now, oh, wow, marriage and their problems. <laughs> ah. I know you are very hungry. Don't worry, I'll soon bring your food, okay? Ah, please do. And thanks for making lunch. Ah, what am I even thanking you? When your brother will finish the whole food. Ask a jobless man. Thank God you know. Thank God you know. Do you know that you have actually changed a whole lot? Look, Amazon. 
you didn't meet my brother jobless. Mm. He was doing well. Well enough to the extent you thought he was the right man for you. Well, I'm beginning to think that I made a big mistake. Excuse you? What do you mean, excuse you? In my house? Oh, so Vicky, you came to my house to insult me. Eh? Okay, you're done here. Leave. No. I said leave! You're leaving. Come out. Can you just stop? Leave. Don't let me push you. Get out. Can you just stop the... Leave! Can you just stop this? Get out. You are leaving my house. Get out! He just leave you are leaving this house today! What is wrong with you? What's going on? What's going on here? What, what, what's going on here? Shut up! Oh, so you brought this woman to my house to insult me, right? And you, what did you do? I did nothing. I did not insult her. Shut up! I said you're leaving this house today! Get your bag. Get your bag! I will leave! Get your bag! Just leave, leave me! Allow me to do it by myself! Get me! Amazon! Shut up! Get out! Amazon, what is wrong with you? What, what is wrong with you? Leave my house! Leave my house! Get out! Leave! Come down. Come on, get out! Leave, leave. I don't want to see your face in this house anymore. Leave! Get out! Get out! Get out! My house is so full. What's the meaning of this? What is wrong with you? You had better be careful, else you will join her. Rubbish. So my wife wants to send me packing from my own house. This is a bad dream. This. <laughs> this is a bad dream. Amazon, where's Essie? I can't find her anywhere. I no longer need her services. Did you employ her? I can't be paying all the bills. Wow. You know, the first time you prayed for me in my dream, I woke up, went to work, and I got sacked. How? I am not the cause of your bad luck. I am not. Henceforth, I am the man of the house. So you must act by my rules. Or else what? I'll throw you out. And one more thing. Make sure you clean the house and prepare my favorite. I should clean the house and prepare your favorite. What's, what's wrong with this girl?
So tell me, do you like the food? At least you're becoming useful. And that's a good thing. What is wrong with you? Well, tell me, what has come over you? You know you didn't have to say that, right? Mm -hmm. Why? Come on, Val. Why? It was necessary I pointed out some certain things to you. At least you know if you're not adding value to this house, I can get rid of you. So I advise that you improve on doing better things. Hmm? I wonder why I made this meal in the first place. Are you leaving? You're not going to eat your food. I've lost my appetite. You've lost your appetite? Yes. Okay. I will help you. I will eat the food. After all, it's my money. I gave you the money to cook the food. So I will eat, I will eat them. <laughs> And that's exactly what I was talking about. You know, everyone in the family would think, oh, because it's Vicky, you know, she's soft-hearted and all of that. That's why she would begin to, you know. Val. Yes. Val. Please, I had a long day. And I need to rest. So if you want to make this call, go outside and make it. Allow me to sleep. <laughs> eh. And who are you talking to? Poor people. Have I not tolerated her long enough? Have I? I've heard you. Good night. What is Val. it? What is it? Hey, hey. Why are you shouting? You better don't talk to me in that tone. No. Don't even talk to me in that tone. What is wrong with you, Val? No, what, hey. is, what is wrong with you? Why, why, why are you starting at this time of the night? Why are you waking me up? Why are you talking to that girl, Vicky? Why? So all of a sudden, Victoria now is that girl. Listen. Vicky is my sister, and I will talk to her whenever I want. Do you have a problem with that? Yes, I do. Val, I have a problem with that. Because I recharge your phone, not for you to waste it on Vicky, but for you to use it on productive things. Not to waste my credit. Telling me I call, you're calling your sister. Say it for the whole world to hear that you're buying me credit. Say it. What's this? Val, I have said what I want to say. Use my recharge card on productive things, not useless things. Just so you know, this was on record. Where do you think you're going to? Hmm? Amazon. My friend, go back and sleep. You're carrying your pillow to wear. Go back and sleep. Go back and sleep. Come and leave this room. Let me see. And please, I don't need noise. 
Allow me to rest. Allow me to sleep. Calling call, call, call my sister indeed. Well, your place is very nice. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Val! 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 Where is this man? Yeah, you called me. Hello. Hi. So you can't answer. What were you doing upstairs? Don't you see that I have a guest? Welcome. Please get us something to drink. Juice. And when you're done, you go and wash the car. I should do what? Wash the car. I want to go to work. Alright. So sorry about that. Is that not your husband? Yes. And is that how you talk to him? Please mind your business. Okay. Hurry up! Uh-uh, where is the juice? What are you doing here? I paid you your money. I'm not owing you. So what are you doing here? Yes, Maya, not owing me. Just the other day, I was passing by and I saw Oga Val cleaning the compound by himself. So I decided to come help Ma. Don't get me wrong. I don't need money. I just want to help. Oh, so you don't need money? Yes, Ma. What do you want? My husband? No, no, Ma. I'm just here to help. Nothing more. Have you helped yourself? Go and help yourself. And I don't want to ever see you in this compound again. Ma, I, Get out! If not helped yourself, you want to help someone. Um, yes, sir. I just checked the account. It seems there was a mistake. Because you sent 30 million naira extra. Yes. Please, can you send me your payment details so I can send the money back? All right, thank you. He sounded surprised. I felt it from his voice. Wow, Amazon. Hi, Toby. You're a real gem. <laughs> Toby, can you stop flattering me? You know I'm married, and I would never cheat on my husband. I hope you know that. I know. I know. But that 30 million there was a test of your integrity. What? 
Congratulations. So I was asked to ask you if you want a full paid trip um, with you and yours or a new car. A test? Yeah, a test. <sighs> so what are you choosing? Um, I want the money instead. So let's say you're choosing the money, you're choosing the new car but in cash. Yes. Exactly. <laughs> okay. Congratulations. Wow. A test. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> no. <laughs> Hello, Amazon. I'm in your office. I didn't see you. Hello, Toby. I'm rushing off to have lunch with someone special. So sorry I didn't invite you. Um, it's fine. Meanwhile, the cash worth of the proposed car has been sent to you. Wow. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. I pity her. I really pity her. No, just imagine you lost everything. Just imagine you lost your job for real. This is how this woman, a woman you have sacrificed for, a woman you did everything for, would have treated you. Huh? I fear my gender. You know it's true what they say, that only women, children, and dogs are loved unconditionally. A man is loved based on his ability to provide. I'm, I'm shocked. I am shocked beyond my imagination. I mean, I thought she loved me. Hmm. We made marital vows and, and here I was thinking that she, she was actually going to stand for me and like she said, nothing will ever change the way she feels about me. This one weak me, So all this was a game? This was a game to test my love for you? Even you, Vicky. You knew about this. No wonder you refused to fight back. You told her you have been sacked. You are broke. And the house doesn't belong to you. And even the car too. Ha. Huh. As a matter of fact, I told her that I am so broke that I am in debt. Make this babe no wrong come off for marriage. Joe. But that is exactly what I want to know. Huh. Look, I'm going to become so bitter. I will deprive her of all her marital benefits. And let's see, of course, I know that a broke man does not deserve ejaculation. <laughs> <laughs> I just hope this doesn't end up in tears. I promise you, it won't end in tears. Now, Vicky, you are going to play a vital role in all of this. Mm hmm because she will be super irritated. So I need you to be tolerant and always to be patient. Always. Mm. Always. Mm. Well, you owe me after this. Well, just get the job done first. And then um, you will find out how much I owe you. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Mm -hmm. Okay, you got a deal. All right. What did I ever do to you? What did I ever do to you? Why do you want to torture me this way? Why? Actually, this was a test of love. And you failed. Awfully. 
This marriage is over. Please leave. Good day, sir. Toby, how are you? Come this way. Very well. Toby. Even you? Hello, Toby. Good day, sir. I need you to relinquish your position. Give it to my wife. And make the employment very juicy. And she's not supposed to know that I know? Absolutely not. All right, sir. I'm sorry I had to act according to the script. The truth is, Mr. Valentine here is the owner and MD of the company. And I'm just an assistant MD. Hence, he has other companies he's running. So, from my end, I think she's faithful. What? But she mentioned going out to have lunch with someone special. If that's you, then she's still your woman. If not, I rest my case. All of you are mad! Nonsense! So who's the special person? You. Okay, I think I'm done for today. Um, Hello, Essay. I'll send you some money so you go to the market. I want to prepare something sumptuous for someone dear to me. All right, so I'm sending you the money now. Mm. All I wanted was to come home to cook for me. Because I haven't done it since I got this job. And I also wanted to give you a check of five million naira. That was the reward they gave me for returning the 30 million naira. I wanted you to use it to start up something. To start up a business. I was coming home to apologize for neglecting and fighting you since I got this job. For nothing went wrong. I was battling all the men that wanted me to grace their bed. The men that you sent to tempt me. I was trying so hard to be polite. I was trying to keep my job and not cheat on my husband. And this is what I get. This is what I get from you. Tell me. Are you so broken that you think that no woman can love a man for who he is? Is that what you think? Is that what this is about? I made a mistake. I admit it. Things didn't feel real with you. Your love, your understanding, your loyalty. I couldn't find Tom. But there were still women who, who loved unconditionally. Please forgive me, please. That means you never trusted me. Even for one day. So why did you marry me? 
I, Why I, did I, you marry me, Val? Why? I'm sorry. We're better off apart. No, my love, no. We're not better off apart. Okay? We're not better off apart. We're better together. Apologize. I'm sorry. I will make it up to you. I will do anything to make it work again. Please. Please. Please, my love.